Hi, I'm Catherine Kavanagh from the Centre for Language and Communication Research at Cardiff University. I'm in the first year of my PhD and my research is about circus. More specifically, it's about representation. So in my title, What's So Special About the Circus? The important part is, and who says so? My two groups of key stakeholders are circus professionals and circus audience members, and that relationship is mediated by public texts. Most people in the UK will have more familiarity with circus performance through its representation in popular culture and media sources rather than first-hand experience of attendance. But in recent years, the circus field has been rapidly expanding and diversifying. For people whose livelihood depends upon audience custom, it's important that the representations available to potential audience members reflect the experience that they're likely to receive. Because studies have shown that audience members are not likely to re-attend an event type unless their expectations are met the first time round. The most direct form of mediation in the producer-consumer relationship comes from promotional texts. So my main research question is, how can the interests of potential audience members and circus professionals be better served by promotional texts? And to answer that, I have to understand what audience members value about their experience of attending a circus production, and whether those values are represented in the legitimised institutional texts that supposedly promote the experience. Promotional texts are made up of the interested genre of publicity blurbs and the disinterested genre of reviews. Reviews, from the perspective of circus professionals, tend to lack relevant knowledge and content. I want to compare the audience perspective. So I'll be collecting a corpus of transcripts of audience interviews that I'll be conducting next summer and a corpus of promotional texts made up of a subcorpus of reviews and a corresponding subcorpus of marketing blurbs. These will account for all the circus productions covered in the UK between February 2019 and January 2020. My findings will triangulate two analyses across the corpora. I'll use the UQREL semantic analysis system to identify key semantic domains which are given relative attention in each corpus. And this will be a marker of where value is communicated through visibility or invisibility. Value is also realised in texts as evaluation, which is a key function of promotional genres. So I'll use Martin and White's appraisal framework to identify targets of evaluation, that is the phenomena being evaluated, and the way they are relatively distributed. Any gaps that are revealed in the corpora also reveal gaps in the mediated relationship between circus producers and circus audiences. Revealing the gaps is the first step towards creating more effective communicative bridges to better serve the livelihoods and the leisure time of my key stakeholders. Thank you, and I look forward to answering any questions in the comments.